I wanted to start early and then uh, I took more time at the breakfast because of their delicious chocolate, hot chocolate. It's more like on the on the heavy side, but it's super tasty and uh, yeah, just delicious. Love it. So I'm heading to uh, Slovenia today. Uh, that will be a, a long road. I, I will uh, I will go through Verona and uh, Udine be the last city in Italy and then uh, Slovenia. With the warm weather the range is improving and uh, it gives me another 80 kilometers. Verona is uh, 58 so it's just about right. Let's see. I have 21% left, say 20% and it gives me a range of uh, 43 kilometers. Yeah, Verona is at uh, exactly 20 kilometers. So we're good. I mean, I will arrive probably with, I don't know. Yeah, 10%. 11%, 25 kilometers range. Obviously, I will charge here. Um, hello. I was supposed to charge here. This is called Brickerman. As you can see, it's a super sexy charging point. A DIY shop. But I, I can't find it. How about this guy over there? Hey, you know where I can charge the bike? <laughs> no, electric. Yes. Electric bike? Yes. Do, do you have like, you know, the plug like the cars? Yes. Uh, uh, wait. Ci sono davanti là, ah, okay. sono. Sono solo qua le hanno tolte, là davanti ci sono delle colonnine vicino right. all'ingresso. Right. Uh, close to the entrance of the shop uh, there is uh, so the entrance is over there yeah uh, over there near the, the entrance there is uh, a totem uh, for, uh, grazie mille you're welcome is it this oh shit what does it mean hey I think it's broken. Ah. Uh, yes. School electric. Yes. Very beautiful. Thank you. Made <laughs> by? Uh, it's called Zero. Zero. It's American. Okay. How many power? It's like uh, 100 horsepower? Uh, it's like uh, 110. How much? 110. Oh. Yeah. Like uh, 600. Uh, yeah, a bit more. Because it's electric, so you, you get like, you know, instant power. Ah, uh, yes. Electric yeah. power, yeah. Yes. <laughs> Very beautiful. Thank you. And then um, for, for stability, it's uh, like a normal. Uh, it's very good. I mean, you see the weight is quite low on the bike. Yeah. yeah. So it's, uh, it's very easy to drive. Yeah, very stable. Kilometers with the one shirt. I do 200. 200? Yes. La, uh, more, uh, medium, who's medium? Well, I was in Milano this morning. Okay. And I need to charge now. Okay. I have like 10% left. Okay. So I need to find a point, but uh, I did, so Milano from here. Yes, yes, yes. In one go.
Thank you. Good ride. Good day. Yes, I found my charging spot. <laughs> this one is super sexy. <laughs> Non disponible. Ça veut dire quoi? Maybe I can try a different card. Lettura tercera. Oh, great. I'm good for 50 minutes. I'd go for a wash. Before heading to our next stop, let's do a a quick tour of the uh, Centro Historico de Verona. There is a a beautiful restaurant just behind that building. I had some uh, some pictures on my uh, Instagram account. Yeah, I remember we had a great lunch here. this at home but uh, the only way to uh, reduce or actually increase your range reduce your consumption on on the highway is to take yourself behind a truck I mean it's a well-known technique it may obviously be dangerous you can see that I'm at 54% and I'm currently using 41% what hour per kilometer at 90 I mean I'm just following that track I wanted to make up the time and uh, either I go by road or I take the highway but at highway speed without doing this I won't be able to make it I just passed the uh, Padova exit that was my initial stop but I'm trying to push it to uh, Previso. I've made it. I have 30% left. And uh, it will be working. See? This is Lexus, Kia. I'm pretty sure they will be surprised to see a motorcycle charging here. But um, yeah, it's good. Uh, that's my lunch for today. No pasta, no pizza. Just a tiny box of tuna. Last stop of the day in Italy. I was a bit on the edge, 8%. But I made it and uh, it was also quite a gamble because I decided to pick the, the free charging at McDonald's. There is only uh, one point. But it's nice. <laughs> Let's do the last leg of the day. Hope it will not be running over there. Yeah. Slovenia. Say 
Nova Gorica, Kranska Gora. Being alone around here, I, I think it's actually the first time I, I realized the pleasure I have with this electric bike because uh, there is no noise, nothing, I mean just a wheeze yeah. so it's not no noise but there, there, there is no loud pipe you know and uh, it's, it's really a pleasure especially here And this is the other side of uh, Verzek Pass. Been one or two since I ran into 